Hey guys, this is iMovie How To showing you iMovie tutorials. Today I'll be showing you how you can resize a green screen clip. As an example clip for this project, we can use the green screen electricity clip as shown in my other video of iMovie Special Effects. You can check it out by clicking on this video where my mouse is. Okay, so let's go to our downloads folder. And let's go to our green screen electricity and import it. Once we have our green screen electricity clip imported, open a browser and type in Chroma Creek, Chroma Creek Green. Then on Google, go to Google Images. Then select an image that has a completely green background, like this one. Now we can just control click, save image as, just save it to our documents folder, save. Okay, so now we can open a new finder window, go to our documents folder, and drag our image into our project. Next, once you have the green screen picture imported, make sure you have advanced tools turned on. So iMovie Preferences, Show Advanced Tools, make sure that's on, because you need that for the next step. So now, shift-click the clip, and drag it over the base green screen, Picture. Now select Picture in Picture. As you can see, there's a green screen up in the green screen clip. Let's, so if you want to make it small, or if you want to, for example, rotate it so you can go to the crop, and ro just rotate like that. So here's it. Ro here's the same effect rotated. A specific size. Once you're done positioning, check to see if the green screen background and the green screen clip have the right background contrast. If they don't have the right background contrast, double click on the clip, go to the video tab. And you'll see these brightness sliders, so just adjust this so it matches the green screen clip. Adjust these sliders, adjust the exposure. So it matches the clip. If you're unable to adjust the background clip, try adjusting the green screen clip. So once you adjusted the clip by either adjusting the background or adjusting the actual green screen electricity clip, go to share, export movie, and export this clip. So let's just save this to our desktop. Um, 720p is fine for me, but if you want the full HD, you're welcome to do HD's 1080p, but I'll just do 720. Say export. It will export it. Now is where we can actually apply the effects, so we don't need this anymore, so we can just delete this, say OK. So now we need our base clip or our background to where we want our green screen electricity effect to be on. So let's just find a background clip to choose. Let's use this clip. So we can just select it and then drag it to our project. After we have imported our base video clip, we can finally apply our effect. So we can go to File import movies and we can find our repositioned green screen clip so we can just import it into our special effects event we can click import wait for it to transfer so now it's copied so now we can drag it over this clip and now we can select green screen And there we go. If adjusting and making the green screen clip work is too is too cumbersome or hard for you, you can also try the pre-key method. Having your pre-key allows you to move the effect anywhere on the screen and allows you to resize it and reposition it real time. What you need to do is download the pre-keyed version by looking in the link in the description. So I can show you what this does by just going to import movies, going to my downloads folder, 
which you'll find the link in the description to download. Go to my pre-keyed electricity effect. I will copy it. My pre-keyed, I can drag it anywhere, not needing to re-export it and have a trial and error system. So I can just select there. I just select picture and picture. I can drag the effect around. Go to the crop. I can turn it. Done. Resize it on the go. And there we go. That's done. And we can play it. That's how you can adjust a green screen clip to what you want. Thank you for watching this iMovie tutorial. To see my other iMovie tutorials, please click the link above. Subscribe to me so you can get future iMovie tutorials. Thank you for watching this video.